Set a new challenge today. What can we get in the corner shop or the local garage? So here's what we've come up with. 15s. That's what we're going to make today. 15s. But personal preference, we've changed the recipe a wee bit. We're not going to be using cherries today. We're going to be using multi-zero buttons. Can't do wrong that. Right, so I've got a few things just to speed the video up a bit, pre-prepared. In here we have the buttons. There's a hundred gram of the Malteser buttons in here. These are all just broke up roughly. This here is 120 grams of butter. Um, it's melted already. And in here we have 100 grams of marshmallows. And in the bowl I've already uh, blitzed up our digestive biscuit. In here we have 200 grams. And that's all blitz. Doesn't need to be perfect, just as long as it's broke down. So, simple as, just put it all in the bowl. All in. Right, so we took a quick break there. I didn't have my gloves on. Now we've got the gloves on. Um, I've got this cling film. This is just two layers of cling film straight across. And then just wipe it down with a towel to get it nice and stuck. So we're just going to scatter some desiccated coconut. Make sure you leave a nice gap either end because we're going to try and tie it. Now with the gloves. So just the heat of the butter and other things, the uh, marshmallows are just breaking up a wee bit there. So we will put this down. So you just want to create a wee log, whatever size, whatever thickness you want your 15s to be. Again, you can alter the recipe, put whatever you want in it, choose a couple of ingredients and uh, just have a bit of fun with it. Right, so that's our log, nicely rolled out. I'll take the gloves off now, just scatter another wee bit. Desiccated coconut all over the top. Here's the important bit, so we grab our cling film by the corners, lift it up. Let it roll naturally. And then just place it down. Bring your hands around. Bring your hands round the back. And just drag it in. Just like that. Just to create a nice log. And then either side, just going to push the 15s up. Drag it down. Then we're going to continue the roll. And then each side. that over and then one just to hold it so that'll hold it nicely so that's our log that's our 15 ready to go put this in the fridge till tomorrow cut it tomorrow morning have it with a cup of coffee for lunch. It's a great recipe. Try it out yourself. Let me know how you get on. Hope you enjoyed.